fake, fake, motherfucking fake. Why, bro? Like, why is y'all trying to fuck up the cannabis community with this bullshit, bro? Like, I got so much shit to tell y'all right now, man. I'm, I'm so hurt and disgusted and disappointed in motherfuckers, man. Like, you, you really got that much heart. You got the audacity to go out here and sell some fake shit to the niggas who wants to enjoy getting high, bro. Don't fuck up our community with this shit, bro. Stop selling this fake shit, bro. Before you sell your shit, you do research about you do research on the shit you selling to people, bro. Just think about it, bro. You you sell this shit. Well, somebody turn around and sell the same shit to your little sister, your niece, your your nephew type shit. Fuck them up for life. You feel me? That type of shit, bro. You a motherfucker to, to just be able to go out here and really sell this shit. You know this shit fake, bro. You know this shit fake, man. Everybody, man, just get a good look at that, man. Everybody get a look, good look at this shit. And for those who have been researching, watching all the fake vape videos and all that shit, as you can tell, whoever been watching them, y'all can tell this is the fake one. This is the fucking fake one. The fucking fake one, bro. I'm going to tell you the story. I'm going to tell you the story of how, how, I, how, how I came across the fake one. Before I even show you the real cartridge, well, I, I don't even got no cartridge on me right now, y'all. I left them at home. Was, um, I'm going through some little shit right now. I ain't serious, but that's, you feel me? Fuck it. But I left the cartridge at home to show y'all the difference. But here's how I, I came across this bullshit. Now, I don't know if I told, I think I did tell y'all in the last video, one of the last videos where, um, uh, we got a fake vape. I got a fake vape. It was some bullshit. Um, okay. Come, come back around to this time. Get the lemon skunk. Now, before I show you this, this packaging, I want y'all to go watch that lemon skunk review. Look at what, look at the packaging on that motherfucker and look at what I just showed you. You feel me? No. I'm addicted to these fucking, first of all, I'm addicted to marijuana, period. So y'all understand me getting addicted to these pens, you feel me? I'm just now getting at the bottom of my pen, bro. The motherfucker's about to touch the coil, look at the cotton part. So I think that's when I did the video. I did another video about this, the lemon skunk. I think I did another, yeah, I did another video. That's when I, you feel me, got to the end. So I'm calling up my, my plug, my little bruh. He ain't got none. I'm gonna tell y'all that story too. I, I don't know if I told y'all, but fuck, I'm gonna tell you again. But he ain't got none, so I'm hurt. Uh, I know somebody who got some, got a, a cartridge from somebody off of, off um, Instagram. A girl that's in Cleveland. I hit her up. She on the west side. She can't meet me. Mind you, my car messed up. I can't drive on the freeway. I stay on the east side of Cleveland. Uh. Yeah, she can't meet me or nothing. She act like she don't want to answer my messages and shit. I guess because I'm a nigga, she think I might try to rob her or something. You know, there's a lot of fucked up shit that happened happen in Cleveland, bro. She might think I might try to rob her, get over on her type shit. I ain't that type of nigga. If you ain't want to come through it, just say it. You feel me? But, okay, couldn't get a hoe to another car. So, and this is around the time I had to go cut my nephew's hair. Now, my nephew... He four years younger than me. My sister, my older sister, I forgot how old she is. She in her late thirties. She had a kid when I was four. So my nephew's four years younger than me. I got she got five kids. But that's the old, that's my oldest nephew. That's my nigga. My nigga. That was my that's like my little brother. He grew up with me. You feel me? That's my little brother. I, I try to tell him everything I know. You feel me? You the same size. He's just bigger. You feel me? He's wider than me. But we the same height type shit. <laughs> but <sighs> I know he smoked weed, so you know how that is. I ain't give a fuck because I smoke weed younger than what he is, so I, I don't care that I might be the first blunt he had or he smoked with me type shit. I don't give a fuck as long as he, you feel me, he know I'm bringing some good shit. I'm not about to fuck my nephew up. All right, I'm going to get off of that part, but I'm cutting his hair type shit. He telling me, yeah, yeah, my nigga, my nigga got this vape. I went on some vapes right now. I'm trying to get tonight. I'm like, oh, so you know somebody who got some vapes now because this other nigga, I guess he ain't had no vapes. Like, bro, I, like I said, I got so much shit to tell y'all, man. I'm telling you, bro. Let me take it. Look at this shit. 
you motherfuckers who selling that fake shit, y'all got me over here smoking nicotine because I don't trust no fucking vapes right now, man. Like, damn. So, he hit his dude up. I'm coming up here, he hit his dude up, trying to pull up. All right, I'm coming out of the nephew here, but he pull up. Um, mind you, I'm supposed to get the Jack Hair flavor. Bet, I want some Jack Hair, you feel me? Um, he pull up, he only got lemon skunk. My, look, look. He only got lemon skunk. I'm looking. I'm like, damn, bro, you ain't got the Jack Hair? I'm like, man, he tried to, um, all right, I'm about to go grab it. Just give me a minute to come back. I'm like, man, fuck it, fuck it, let me get that, let me get that. I had it already, fuck it, I just need something. My nephew told me he charged forty dollars. So I don't care a little five dollars more than what I usually pay. I tell him, uh, all right, here go forty. He's like, oh no, they forty five. Four five. Four five. <laughs> Nigga, you got me fucked up. I say I'll give you forty one. I got a, a dollar and change in my pocket. He's like, all right, man, fuck it. No, he tried it. He tried it, but I, he tried to hit me with the, uh, you know what? I'm about to slide. I'm sliding back around her later on tonight. I'm gonna hit you up. I'm like, no, nah, bro, I got 41. I got an extra dollar, you feel me? I need that. I need it. So, I get the vape cartridge. I didn't I didn't look at it. I didn't look at it good enough, you feel me? I had to hurry up and go finish my other nephew head. So, and then I had to bounce. And I had to go, um, I had a, I had hella hair to cut that day. And that was, oh, nigga. What fucking day was that? 420. This is 420, bro. Bought a fake fucking cartridge on 420, man. So, I got a, I got a 420 party to go to. I got hair I got hair to cut after that. I got my best friend hair to cut. My little sister had somebody from um from Bowling Green University. Um he needed a haircut. He came to Cleveland and shit. He needed a cut. So I had, I had a haircut. Plus the 420 party to go to first. Of, and and for all that, I had a, a drunk Uno little session to go to. So I'm getting busy. I ain't check my vape until I got to the drunk Uno. Now, I had lemon skunk before. I'm looking, I pulled a vape out my pocket. I'm ready to bust this bitch open. I'm getting drunk. I'm ready to hit the fuck off this vape. <laughs> bust that bitch open. This bitch filled to the top. The cartridge is filled to the top. The top I've never I looked at it, I'm like hold on bro that's what threw me off I'm like no bubble every vape I ever got had an air bubble in that motherfucker this bitch fell to the top <laughs> skeptical about that I'm like man fuck it <laughs> screw that bitch on her I hit it I'm like alright what threw me off when I hit it I had my vape set to the same temperature that I had when I was smoking the last lemon skunk. So this one I knew it was some type of different oil. It wasn't burning right, because when I hit it, the smoke was light. The temperature that I had on, on that lemon skunk, it gave me a nice dense cloud. This cloud was light. I had to turn this bitch up to damn near what I what I turned my nicotine level up to. You feel me? Y'all see where I'm coming from? Okay, that threw me off right there. I didn't have the other packaging to compare the motherfucker. I went, I was too geeked to really try to look into it type shit. So I'm like, man, don't don't let this be a fake vape, man. Don't make me have to hurt a young nigga, man, because I really hurt this little nigga, bro. And what pissed me off so bad, I ain't got it like everybody. I keep it one hundred with you. I ain't got it like everybody. I work I work eight hours, five dollars, five days a week for 10 30 a fucking hour you feel me i ain't making shit just enough to get by so for me to spend my last 41 fucking dollars on some bullshit man i was ready to hurt that little nigga bro i told my nephew bro next time he call you let me know tell that nigga pull up i want another vape another vape you feel me i was on it bro Okay, so my dumbass, I should never did this, bro. And DeRay, bro, I apologize for even letting you do this shit. I um peer pressure my nigga into smoking, smoking some bud with us. He played football and shit. He ain't smoked since I can't remember, like January, February. 
I'm like, bro, um, got to smoke, bro. So he bet me and my nigga Charles. All right, y'all drink that cup. I, I roll the bun and smoke that bitch. I'm like, hey, you got to hit this pen, bro. You know, I got bet. Let him hit the pen. He choking hard. He hit it hard. I'm like, okay. Then he said he feeling. I'm like, okay, it might be some shit. No, it wasn't, bro. I'm drunk. I'm not listening, bro. The right, bro. I apologize for letting you hit this bullshit, bro. This shit could have killed you. It could have killed me. I don't know what it was. I apologize, my nigga. That's my, that's my best friend I'm talking about, bro. But uh, okay. Fast forward. I put the shit back in the, in the package. I said, man, fuck this. I'm not about to keep hitting this shit. Get home. I said, let me compare these motherfuckers. It's clarity. This is not lemon skunk. It don't taste like lemon skunk. I ain't, I ain't, I forgot to mention that. It didn't taste like lemon skunk. I just had this shit. Literally, that day, that morning, I had lemon skunk. <sighs> oh, yeah, yeah, I got another tap. But, um, I'm about to show you the real cartridge. I mean, the real packaging. The last bit of real packaging that I've seen of dank fucking vapes. Look at it. Look, look. First of all, when I got it from my nigga, the box was already, like, dingy like i don't want to say like dingy but like you can see the whites of the cardboard you feel me um so i already been through some shit i ain't tripping but look at it look at this shit this is a real let me put the fake up here look at this fake let me, let me put that shit side to side look at this shit look at it first of all on the real one dank vapes is at the top Lemon skunk is at the bottom. That's first off. Second of all, look at Pepe Le Pew. He big as fuck on the fake one. He light as fuck on the fake one. Look at him on the, on the real one. He a little smaller and his yellow, oh shit, <laughs> I'm fried. His yellow, his yellow is darker. It's a darker yellow. I don't know if you can tell by the lighting, but it's a darker yellow. And um what this is the biggest noticeable thing that you can find on a fake dank vape. Look at the small images. Look at the small images. Look at the, the small images as in the small images like these lemons. Any dank vape you get, they got these small images. If they don't pop out the box too, it's fake. Look at this shit. Look at the lemon. You can't even see the lemons on this motherfucker. Look at these lemons. Where's these lemons? Now you see me, now you don't type shit. You feel me? Fuck out of here, bro. I ain't mean it. I ain't mean to disrespect the, the real dank vape. My bad. I ain't mean to disrespect you. That's the, oh, that's, come on, man. Niggas out here filling these bitches up with pesticides, filling over all type of bullshit, bro. I feel bad. I just watched it. I just watched some YouTube. Dude, what made me make this video, because I've been wanting to make it, I had these motherfuckers sitting in my work pocket. What made me really make it today, because I was just watching some videos, like four videos about fake dank vapes. And two of them had niggas smoking the fake dank vapes. These niggas are doing reviews with fake dank vapes. I'm sitting here, I'm commenting like, bro, I feel bad. I'm about to watch this nigga kill himself off this fake dank vape. He's about to die. And he's, he's taking, bro, niggas taking fat hits of this fake shit. Now, I wish I had the, 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 the cartridge to really show you. You feel me what to look for? But, oh yeah, to show you more noticeable shit. Oh shit. Nah fake one the opening is in the front now if you ever see a fucking dank vape that you can see the opening in the front is fake bruh real dank vapes the opening is on the side you feel me to show you the, the vape is on the side and if you ever get a dank vape that has a real dark color to it bruh bruh it had a dark color to it i just had lemon scum bruh. my shit was light colored bruh that bitch had a dark color to it no air bubble and another thing when i was hitting it it kept creating smaller bubbles inside it was creating smaller bubbles inside that kept flowing to the top i'm like bro this shit fake i thought i, I threw that shit out i'm watching all these niggas hit these fake, fake dang vapes i'm like man as soon as i see the video he showed the the, the, the cartridge 
as soon as I seen this opening and I seen it was smooth all around, I'm like, man, that shit fake. It's fake. Hey, don't try to sit around arguing me, try to prove to me that you feel me that it's real. You gonna hate it, try to tell me that it's real. No, bro, I know what you feeling. I know exactly what you feeling because that's exactly what I felt when I hit this shit. It's like, you be waiting for that, that how I wanna say, that, that distillate, that terpene type hit in your throat, but you don't get it. But what, what, what this shit left was a burning feeling. That burning feeling you get when you take a deep hit of this shit. So that's what made me think, like, bro, is this shit? No, it's not. It's not hitting right. It's probably burning, but it's not hitting like terpenes, distillate type shit. You feel me? So, think about Cleveland and Ohio. No, I just watched a video of, of, with a female from Chicago. She said, like, dang vapes done flooded the market. No, it's not only Chicago, bro. Dang vapes, low key. I don't want to say dang vapes flooded everywhere because they flooded Cleveland, too. We was getting a bitch. It's heavy. And now it's flooding with all this fake shit. Every dang vape I see right now has been fake. It been every dang vape I've seen in the past two months has been fake. Well, I ain't gonna say in the past two months since I had bought mine. Been been fake since I bought them that sour diesel. Then I bought them the miscon. It been fake ever since I made that video, bro. They out here now. One of my niggas hit me up on the spot. Show me a picture of his shit. I'm like, oh, you got some vapes. He's like, you feel me? Yeah, I'm selling. I'm about to sell them off um, again on Friday shit. You feel me? 35, 2 for 50. I'm a bet. I've been looking for some. So when y'all you know, look at the picture, I'm like, bruh, I don't feel me want to come at you no type of way, but bruh, I think them bitches fake, bro. He's like, no, oh, bruh. I'm again, huh? I'm like, man, listen, bro. You my nigga. You know I smoke bud. You know I do all this, this weed shit, bruh. I ain't gonna tell you nothing wrong, bro. The reason I tell you this is because I don't want you to get finesse, bro. Don't go buy that big package of them, package of them fake dang vapes and you, you feel me, you fuck your name up selling some bullshit or you feel me, you don't make your money back because it's some bullshit. You feel me? So he like, all right. I'm like, man, matter of fact, call me. We talk, we chopping it up. He's showing me the shit. I'm like, bro, is, is the is the is the the designs popping out the, the, the box? He's like, yeah, bro, look at the strawberry. He has a strawberry cup. He's like, yeah. Look at the strawberry. I'm like, yeah, I wasn't paying attention. But he like, yeah, look at it, it's popping up. Oh, it might be real, bro. It might be real. No. Eventually I click click back in my mind, like, bro, the dang vest at the bottom. Strawberries around that bitch supposed to be popping out the box, bro. I'm telling you. He like, all right. Well, you come over and cut my hair, I'm gonna let you see him and you tell me. Before I can even come over and cut his hair, he hit me up. Yeah, bro, I think they fake. Think. Think, nigga, I knew they was fake. I knew it. I just, I got finessed twice already, bro. Third time's a charm, bro. You're not about to fool me, bro. I know, bro. I know what these fake vapes look like. I know what they taste like. If I can't get no starter hit, I don't want to know. I know what they taste like, bro. So, like, man, y'all be careful, man. Be careful. Shit is real out here, bro. I used to love things before they even got the new packaging. Bro, I used to love dank vapes. What's going on, y'all? Y'all buying shit from China? There's some shit that anybody can get. Bro, all this packaging and shit, you get this shit from China, bro. You can order this shit offline. Fill that shit up yourself. That's what niggas doing, bro. I heard trying to kill niggas, bro. You don't know what that shit gonna do to a nigga, bro. Don't hospitalize a nigga for over a fake vape. Does he want a couple dollars, my nigga? I'll slap the shit out your bitch ass, bruh. Excuse off my language, bruh, but I'm pissed, man. Niggas really trying to fuck shit up for us, man. We ain't trying to do nothing but bring peace to the world, bruh. Y'all doing this type of shit, making nigga want to kill your bitch ass. But I'm sorry, y'all. I'm getting out of hand. I'm getting out of hand. And it's really because of this shit, bruh. I ain't even got no pen to smoke to calm myself down. I got to hit the nigga team. This nigga team ain't doing shit for me. It's not doing shit, bruh. It's got to stop. It's got to stop today, bruh. All this fake vape shit, bruh. Stop, bruh. Why you... Come on, bruh. I'm sitting here thinking about it now, bruh. I done hit two, two fake vapes, bruh. I wonder what's... What... I don't want to say it. Tragedy is going to happen from somebody hitting the fake vape. And I hope that the the... The smoke that I did in hell from them vapes didn't damage my lungs. You feel me? I hope that it, it doesn't create nothing long term type shit. You feel me? I don't want to find out a couple years later that I got some shit because I had some shit from back in the day. You feel me? Y'all calm that shit out, bro. Get some real shit. Sell that shit. Be, be legit, bro. Why you want to fuck your name up selling some bullshit? 
and only only real niggas like me gonna know that it's some bullshit. You feel me? All these niggas I just watch or do reviews on fake vapes. They wasn't fake vape videos. They were reviews on the vapes, but they were fake and they didn't know until they I guess they read them comments. Other than that, they was on that video fucking themselves up, trying to give us a review. Because you want to sell us some bullshit, bro. You can't sell my nigga some good shit so he can give us a review and let us know what it's like so we can get the shit. Man, get the man, y'all, y'all, man. What's man, it's crazy out here, man. Man, y'all be careful with these fake vapes, man. Try to get you an official plug, man. If you can't, I don't even recommend you to try looking, bro. Because even platinum vapes, I used to get them. Got a fake one. Some shit called Supreme. It's supposed to be gravity perb. I thought, man, that shit didn't get me high at all, bro. Bullshit. You feel me? Like, bro, you can't trust nothing nowadays, man. Can't trust nothing but your good old original weed, good old original bud, good old original cuz, you feel me, some bag. You can't go wrong with bag at all. You feel me? So, man, y'all be careful, man. Be careful what you put. Make sure you, you, you look at what you puffing on, bro. Don't kill yourself trying to get high, bro, because niggas will kill you while you trying to get high. Niggas will kill you trying to get high. Just think about that shit, y'all. I'm out of here. I'm about to finish out my motherfucking shift, which is only 12.30. Nigga, I'm out here at 6 in the morning. Look how much time I got left. Got me some Red Bulls. About to get it popping, man. Y'all be careful out there, man. I, I had to bring y'all a video on some real nigga shit. Had to, had to come at y'all real. I'm still at work, my nigga. <laughs> had to come to y'all real, bro, because this shit killing me, bro. It's pissing me off, man. It's pissing me the fuck off, bro. And I apologize. I feel sorry for everybody who has been fucked over with a fake vape and had to ingest some shit that they don't fucking know they, what they ingested, bro. I feel so sorry for y'all. I feel sorry for myself. Because I ingested some bullshit. I don't know what it was. I have asthma, bro. I have asthma. Marijuana is the only thing that's been keeping my asthma suppressed. I haven't had asthma attack since I started smoking heavy. It's been years since I had an asthma attack. If I ever wheeze right now, it's because of a seasonal change, allergy to dust or some shit, or I'm out working out and you know, I know I'm out of shape type shit. Other than that, no, I don't have asthma attacks. So I feel sorry for y'all, man. I hope everything turns out good. Um, watch out for fake vapes, y'all. I can't come to you no really than this, bro. I'm just, a, I'm just a, a fucking stoner trying to let all my fellow stoners know what's going on out here, man. It's real, y'all. That's some real shit. I love y'all, bro. Make sure y'all smoke one for me. I ain't gonna get hot till I get off. Because of these dumb fucks. I love y'all, bro. It's gone gang shit. New tat. That screen face with the blade at the bottom of it. You can't really tell right now. It's just, uh, 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 uh. All right, y'all. It's on.